bed. It feels really sore. Hiya. Hi. Yeah, you've caught the sun. Oh, a Navi's tan to go in my Navi's muscles. Well, hope you've got a Navi's appetite. I have. Oh, that smells beautiful. Oh, there you go. This came. Second post. Oh. Hope so. Ooh. From Andy. He's having a great time on the new farm. And a photo. Oh. <laughs> well, considering all the aggro at school, his writing's not half bad. Oh, that's his dad's. <laughs> now, you see the cross at the bottom, that's his dad's. <laughs> Dangerous things, educated women, Jack. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me about it. I'll stick it up here, shall I? Where we can see it. Much easier than living with the real thing, eh? Must be true what they say about absence making the heart grow fonder. Could you pass the bread, please, Rachel? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you could at least give me a hand. It's about a laugh watching. You? Go on, let's help you. Uh, hiya. Hi. Hi. Someone to see you, Rachel. Oh, really? Cheers. <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh, I did it. Keith Billing. Hi. You won't know me from Adam. No, sorry. And I've heard a lot about you from your mum. Oh, really? We've, um, we've been going out together. All oh, right. I was just thinking I'd have to surprise her, take Joseph over for the weekend. You'd hardly recognise him. That's a great idea. I'm sorry, Rachel. I didn't want to phone out. I wanted to tell you to your face. Tell me what? I'm sorry, Rachel. Your mum's dead. She was uh, taken to hospital yesterday afternoon. It turned out to be a brain hemorrhage. She died in theatre. I'll take Joseph back. Can you follow us when you're ready? All right. How did you meet? Uh, I have a shop in Walkley, fruit and veg and that. She used to come in every week. We, uh, we just got chatting. She was right cagey to start with. <laughs> Took a long time to get to know her. She never used to be like that. It was... Well, she changed. Uh, she, uh, she told me about prison. I think she thought I'd run a mile. Well, these things happen, don't they? You never know what's round the corner. No. That was another part of her life. She was a different woman altogether. Right, quiet, modest. That's what I liked about her. She'd do art for anyone. I thought you might like this. It's Joseph. I sent this to her the week he was born. She uh, kept it in her purse. Did, did you speak much about him? A bit. Look, I've never believed all that stuff about people pulling together in a crisis. I found that out when my wife died. What did she say? No, she loved you all right. She just accepted the fact that you weren't going to be close. I think perhaps it suited her. Well, she lost your dad, Joe, Mark. You'd want to keep people at arm's length after that. It must have been hard for you. That was her way. Controlled. She hardly ever had a drink. Oh, a glass of wine maybe on a special occasion, but very controlled, very gentle. She were a lady. I'm so sorry. Thanks. Would you like me to come back with you? I mean, I don't like the idea of you spending the night on your own. We thought she could stay here. I'd like that. But at least let me take Joseph back with me. One less thing for you to worry about. Thank you.